Hey everybody, my name is Florida Man and I want to talk to you about snakes. Most people do not like snakes, but we can appreciate their existence in that they help with keeping the small rodent populations from getting out of control. As Floridians, we care a huge deal about our wildlife and ecosystem. We have many animals that exist only in this state. One of the biggest problems facing wildlife conservation in the state of Florida is the invasive Burmese python. Florida has been dealing with invasive pythons for over two decades and estimates the number of pythons to be about tens of thousands. If we do not take this problem more seriously, the impact on South Florida's wildlife will be devastating. The Burmese python has become a huge threat to the South Florida ecosystem. The problem started in the 1980s when the industry for exotic pets grew in substantial demand and Miami became the home to thousands of exotic snakes including Burmese pythons. Because of how large these snakes can grow, many irresponsible owners have abandoned their snakes in the Florida Everglades and left them to fend for themselves. The snakes have thrived in the South Florida Everglades because the habitat is like their native environments in Southeast Asia. These snakes have severely reduced the number of small and medium-sized mammals. Large animals such as deer, have been discovered in the bellies of pythons. 77% of rabbits released with radio transmitters have been devoured by pythons. Raccoon, opossum, and bobcat populations dropped severely. The count of small mammals has significantly decreased to a shocking number, nearly zero. Marsh rabbits, cottontail rabbits, and foxes effectively disappeared. The Burmese python is an apex predator, and in the Everglades, has no natural predators. The snakes have replaced the Florida alligators and panthers as the top predator. The alligators and panthers now must compete for the same food source. As the devastating effects of the python became clearer, authorities began working with other authorities in the state, as well as the public, to eradicate the python problem. A law was passed in 2010 that made it illegal to own a python in the state of Florida. 2017 introduced the Python Elimination Program, which hires people to hunt for pythons. There are also many python hunting competitions hosted every year, which can include cash prizes. Overall, if we ignore this issue and not continue the steps of eradication of these invasive snakes, the impact on South Florida's wildlife will be devastating. Some species can even go extinct. We must do what we can to eliminate this threat. Thank you 